Hello everyone, I'm Rodney from 3GameMan.com and today I'm having a look at a very slim all-in-one liquid CPU cooler from Silverstone. It is their TD-02 slim model. How thick is it? Well, with the radiator and the fans together, it's only 37 millimeters thick. That's very impressive and what it will do is allow you to install the rad plus the fans in places that you wouldn't be able to fit other all-in-one liquid CPU coolers. So let's have a look. There's nothing wrong with this box. Looks awesome and it has lots of pictures as well as features and specifications about the product on it. Inside at the very top you'll find a user's manual as well as a quality piece of styrofoam. And by the way, this is packaged extremely well. Another piece of styrofoam here surrounding the very slim reader. It is also in a plastic bag. More plastic here. The slim fans are in another bag. And in this box, they include all the mounting hardware, so you can install this on just about any current socket, thermal compound, a sleeved four pin Y fan cable, as well as a Molex to four pin power adapter. Mounting fans to the radiator is really easy. Just use the included eight screws. These all-in-one liquid CPU coolers are very popular today, and there's really no wonder. They are all sealed, so you really don't have to worry about leaks. They are relatively affordable affordable, perform extremely well, and are easy to install. Now they are not going to perform as well as traditional water cooling setups, but they will perform better than CPU air coolers. Of course, they're going to cost a little bit more. What you have here is the radiator, the fans, the tubes, the pump, the water block, all in one package. Let's first start with the radiator. It measures in at 273 by 120 by 22 millimeters. That's the length, the width, and the height, and it's aluminum. It comes with two 120 by 120 by 15 millimeter PWM fans, and each fan has a four pin connector. The speed is from 800 to 2200 RPMs. The noise level is from 16.5 to 27.4 decibels. The rated voltage is 12. The rated current is 0.02 to 0.15 amps, and the airflow is 13.1 to 35.86 CFMs. These rubber tubes are 300 110 millimeters in length, super durable and flexible. And by the way, they are securely attached to the reader and the water block. The water block measures in at 65 by 65 by 39.5 millimeters. It has a solid copper base as well as a blue LED here at the top. The pump that's inside is powered by this three pin connector. The motor speed is 2,500 RPMs. The rated voltage is 12 and the rated current is 0.35 amps. Now this is a perfect option if you're tight on space but still want a 240 millimeter AIO. I know from personal experience, if you put a regular size rad and fans at the top of some cases, it will hit the board or the connectors and it simply is just too tight and it doesn't work. So this AIO gives you that flexibility. Of course, you're not dealing with regular fans here or a regular reader. It's not as thick and the fans are not going to be as powerful, but still it does perform extremely well. Great job, Silverstone. Overall, this is a 100% kick-ass product. Until next time, take care. Well, that's it, but I hope you enjoyed the review. And if you think this and other videos that I produce are great, please like them and subscribe to the channel. Also, your comments are very welcome. And if you have any questions, let me know.